if you are looking for a new toilet seat maybe it's because whatever that you have been using it is not comfortable or it has some issues or you're moving into your dream home you want the best cost effective and you're wondering like what are some of the things that i need to consider before i get a new toilet seat well i want to tell you some of the things that you might really need to to know before you go out there and start hunting for your favorite or for your ideal toilet seat welcome to my channel my name is rachel and i was going through the comments and dms that requested videos and i saw a couple and i am in the process of determining what i am comfortable sharing which i will be doing once in a while i will be picking a requested video and doing so one of the interesting requested video is how i clean my toilet interesting right so uh i think the reason why i got that is because a while back i did a video a uh, bathroom cleaner a happy uh review so yeah so i think that is where the person who requested that is coming from before i do the requested how i clean my toilet then i figured out i should do a video of something that i would want you to know so this is how easy it is going to be i want to show you something that i think you need to see or let you know about something that i think you need to know one thing you should know about toilet seats ni kwamba it is a one a size fits all situation so all the toilet seats will usually like have the same like um, measurement or something the only difference will be the shape it will be either a rounded one or the elongated one depending on what your toilet uh, bowl is shaped like that is the toilet seat you should be aiming for of course you can't aim for a round toilet seat when you have a elongated uh, toilet bowl so first things first you need to know the shape of your toilet bowl most of the toilet seats zimemekiwa na polypropylene which is very good anti stain and easy to clean and all that they are also wooden and they are also like cushion uh, toilet seats so again you need to know what you're going for all of those have their own advantages and, and their own disadvantages ranging from concerns that you might have like hygiene based and at the same time cost related um, concerns not forgetting issues to do with maintenance how you're going to maintain the whole thing whether you're cleaning supplies it as a wear off and stuff like that so let us start with the plastic kind uh, um, toilet seats which are like mostly available they are affordable they range in different colors and they are easy to maintain so those are okay and they are very good for as long as the material like i have talked about is that but they have the disadvantage of usually like being cold if you have one of those nani july you know you know what i mean you know it really like yeah it is not fun sitting there on the other side you know very well ziko resistant to stains scratches akuna here and there and they don't chip as easily and also you are cleaning supplies that could just like uh damage the surface won't do a thing to them the wooden toilet seats know how to manage them you need to know how to treat them because if you don't then you're going to have some hygienic issues so get your wooden uh, toilet seats knowing that you have some extra um, work to be done not every cleaning supply will work for them for example you're not going to scrub them with your brushes for example and so many other things that you can't do with the wooden seats for the cushioned toilet seats you are going to enjoy the ride because they usually like soft and warmer but again you're going to spend a little bit more money when you buying them and you're going to think about the long term whereby you're going to be replacing them every now and then because of the wear and the tear you won't be able to use them as much as you would have used the plastic toilet seats you can also consider to have some heated toilet seats if that is your thing you're worried about the the cold situation and stuff like that uh, toilet seats 
knowing that you have some extra um, work to be done not every cleaning supply will work for them for example you're not going to scrub them with your brushes for example and so many other things that you can do with the wooden seats is it a bolt and a nut that you can just uh, get instantly like configure out how it is supposed to be put ama it is the ones that you need to drill if it is the ones that you need to drill then there is a problem because uh installing them it is work and in case you need to remove them from there maybe you're moving it will be work again or maybe when it is damaged and you want to overall like uh, change a few things in your bathroom it will be a lot of work if you have a toilet seat and you can tell that it is not as clean as it should be and you always put yourself out there cleaning it and everything you know how embarrassing it is and some people might be thinking wait this one is not even um tidy like organized bona toilet seat yake inaka cream orange or blue that does not mean that person is dirty or something but some of the um toilet seats tunapata kwa hizi rentals they can be really like nasty if you know what i am talking about utumie cleaners that cause a lot of money and then finally what you get embarrassment so i want to tell you about this toilet seat because first of all this is not a promo second i think it is something everyone would want to have because one it's not like super super expensive it is available so this is the the thing it is by home and bath and it is a kenyan product see that so that is what they are saying it is comfortable and economic stain and break resistant it is a euro plastic material with highest hygienic ratings it fits most models and shapes of the toilet or the bowls and it is universal and has a simple and nut bracket type hd Remember I told you if you choose the integral bolt and nut you will have to do some uh, drilling which is not fun when installing everything but this is just a easy peasy kind of business it is quick and easy to install that one I can tell you for sure it has a tight fit that means when you sit on it it does not go side and side when you're doing your business the installation you see how easy it is it is just put this here and this and before this i had a toilet seat that had like the same fixing just put this here squeeze this fix this but it used to like slide when someone sits on it so you're there you are doing your business listen that is nasty period so you want something that will enable you to sit do your thing and just go the fact that every time i clean my toilet and uh, like the boy business goes on then you can get those little little stains here and there and because obviously we say lift up everything but they, they don't anyway <laughs> so eventually you realize that uh the stains they, they get off of course because we use the stain removers which is jig for me but at the same time you realize that the toilet is not as clean as white every day when i am cleaning the toilet i just get the disinfectant spray it on and wipe it through and it, it turns out to be very very clean let me show you the toilet seat it is very stable first of all you see that it is very very stable don't mind the the whatever stain on the johnson it's because of some glue some repairs were being done a while back so this is the toilet seat very decent very good if you're looking for a toilet seat that is not going to cost you a lot of money something that is available something that fits your toilet nicely you won't regret and i forgot to tell you how warm this toilet seat is it does not get like super cold and yeah boring like the first few seconds you see to napigwana shokia baridi then think about getting this 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 
uh, equipment from home and bath like i said it is not a promotion by any chance it is something that i thought since someone asked for a toilet related video then i should be telling you about this because i need to be telling you about products that i think are worth and products that i think could be a waste of your money so friends that is it for today thank you so much for being here thank you for always being here my name is rachel in case you forgot remember it is mondays wednesdays and saturdays on pm time i'll see you then <laughs>